Hi everybody. Welcome to an exciting and peaceful new edition of Yoga with Ari. I'm your host Yogi Ari and today Can you hear that? That's what the trucks do here. They just scream out deals they have on like fresh turkey and stuff. Anyway, pull up a coffee, put some whiskey or vodka in it, shake off the hangovers, and just let's get enlightened. We're starting our feet today. This will be a nice, easy one. We're getting ready for our January 30 or 31-day challenge. I looked it up. It's 30. It's literally 31 days. Uh, so just let's shake it out. Let's get a nice, easy. Kind of, kind of do your own thing. We're at peace today, you guys. We're really at peace. Do the uh, whatever it takes to shake it out. Backwards. Ah, ooh, this is actually pretty good. And forwards. Mm, I made a nice fire yesterday. <sighs> Had a cigar. Okay, let's just work on some arm stretches to start with, shall we? Now let's warm it up first. Feet shoulder width apart. And all we're gonna do is just kind of like go down to the right leg. Eat. It's just warm ups, y'all. It's just warm ups. And the left leg. Try to keep those knees straight. Ah. Good warm up. Right leg, left leg, swing like a monkey. Okay. Here we go. Let's start. Right leg on your left as high up as you can. Oh, almost popping. What we're doing here is leaving it, and then we're just gonna like try to like come over the top. There's no way you're gonna be able to do that. Oh, not bad. Okay, and then back up. Ow. Guys, I'm, I'm legit, that might not be a move. I'm not gonna lie to you. I lie to you a lot. Okay, and then just, I think you might have to bend the knee here. If you don't, then you're better than me and congratulations, you don't need this. Nice, easy bend over. Ow. Tony, make those ingredients, and then I'll make the omelets later. Okay. Ow. Start with some coffee. Okay, let's do the arm stick. This is what I want to do today. I guess you can go down. Watch this. Left leg, left arm behind you. Right arm over the top, also behind you. Try to lock him in. Okay, you see that? And then what we're gonna do is gonna bend over at the top. Oh, that's that hurts. That hurts my bottom, my left arm. Ow. Okay. Keep it. Now go backwards. Ow. And then, okay, okay. Other arm, switch it. This one I'm not as good at. Yep, got it. If you can only get this close, I don't know, get that close. Grab some t-shirt or some shit. Ready? And then over the top. Ah, uh, yeah, that stretches out that bottom arm pretty good. And then back. Oh. One more time forward. And then backwards. Oh. As long as we're on the ground, let's go to the ground. A little old foot dick. Remember foot dick, you guys? If you don't know what foot dick is, you take your feet and you make a dick out of it. Does that make sense to you? Foot, dick. Should make sense. If it doesn't, I don't know. Okay, uh, grab underneath your toes. Um, you want your heels as close into your taint as possible. If you can, if you have long balls like I do, you will feel the bottom of your balls touch the inside of your heels. If you have regular sized um, balls 
or a muff that's not fucking completely shattered by childbirth and age, then um, you probably won't feel anything. But all we're doing here is just leaning forward. Try to keep your neck outwards. Ah, fuck. It is sunny today. Mm. And just hold it there. Five, four, three, two, one. Now you guys, every week I tell you to have something to be thankful for at the end of the class. Ow! So start thinking about what that is gonna be. Remember, this is once a week in December. But in January, we're going every day. So you gotta get into this shit. All right. Back of your mat. Uh, right leg in. Right at your taint again. Try to keep your right knee down, and all we're doing is reaching up and over towards that uh, left foot. Ready? Stretch up first. Hold it there for a minute. Or maybe we'll do this. Maybe we'll do this first, actually. I'm gonna turn backwards. Stretch the back a little bit so we don't pop it when we reach. Oh, tons of ash just coming out of that fucking cauldron right there. Let's get in my coffee. Okay. Other way to the left. <sighs> nice stretch. Okay. And up and over. Ow, right there is where I fucking feel it. Right there. Ah, okay. Ah. Try to keep that knee down. Try to keep this knee down. Try to keep the head up. Ah. Oh, for three, two, one. Ooh, not bad. And fuck that. Okay. Other leg. Ah, into the taint. First, we're going to go over the left side. Oh. Hello, coffee, my old friend. I come to shit on you again. You help to open up my uh, loose bowels. Okay. And then the right side, and then what did I tell you? The same thing as before. Keep the left knee down, which I'm not doing. Go up, keep the left knee down, Ari. Why is that one harder? Oh, because I've shattered that leg. Ready, and over the top. Right there, I can't do it anymore. Ow. Left knee down. Ow. Three, two, keep stretching, not popping one. Ow. Ow. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to the playlist on YouTube. Ow. Okay. Okay. Let's try it. Ooh. Let's try another one as long as we're in here. No, I know what we'll do. Go to your knees. Backwards. We're gonna do a bridge. We're gonna try to sneak a bunch of Mexicans through the border. You gotta go behind you like this. If you guys know how to do it, then fucking do it, please. Ow, this is definitely wrong. Start over. Ow, this is definitely wrong. Okay. Hold on to your feet. That's what it is. I fucked it up completely. Uh, take your hands underneath you like this. Ready? And just go up to your head. Now all those Mexicans are coming in. They're not taking our jobs. All that shit was ridiculous. No one does. This is hacky already, but no one does jobs Mexicans do. I don't even know where my broom is. And you're saying I should clean up and sweep? Nah, fuck that. Fuck that. Mexicans, come on in. Come on in, one by one, underneath the tunnel. Two by two. If you have a kid, you will be separated from your child. Donald Trump used cages and separated his child. Who built those cages? Barack Obama. Get to know politics. I don't really know anything about it. Okay. Ow. Oh. That was the best one, the Associated Press. <laughs> Michelle Obama. <laughs> I just hate when people are phonies. When she's like, Donald Trump has built these cages and separated children from their... And then the Associated Press was like, ah, your husband built those. Like, shh. Oh, that was a good one. Let's do that again. We'll do it in a little bit. Let's do pretzel. 
uh, right knee, right like this. Uh, left leg over it, okay? I don't know, I shouldn't say like this. Somebody, I had a yoga instructor tell me like, why do you say like this? You have to explain what it is. It's visual, do you guys see it? No one's listening to this. Okay. So, left leg is over. Um, that right knee, I'm burning already, I can see it. Um, you want your right elbow up and over this left knee and then just twist it in. Ow. Ow. By the way, you can do some of these moves while you're fucking. Let me explain to you in a second. First, we're gonna deep pretzel. Three, two, one. Okay, that is my favorite. This is one of my favorites, if not my favorite. Don't move your feet. But get up without moving them. I mean, you can move them a little bit, but keep them sort of in the same spot. And twist. And now you're back down the other way. Pretty cool. If you're into like totally not cool stuff. If you're into drugs, this is not that cool. But if you're not into drugs, you're pretty straight edge, it's pretty cool. Hey, I found an Instagram account you should actually follow. Daily, yoga Daily Poses or something like that. Ah, they just have some poses and you can fucking throw it. We should do one of these where I'm like, hey, throw in your own favorite pose now. Ow. Maybe actually if you guys have a good pose you want me to use, can you guys ow, do a hashtag Yogi Ari or Yoga with Ari? Or just tag me on Instagram. <sighs> My favorite pose. I don't know, something like that. We should come up with the hashtag. Yogi Ari. And then, uh, and then I'll use your poses. Let's get up. Oh, that coffee's getting cold. <sighs> okay. <sighs> Into your mat. <sighs> I know how to do this. Downward facing dog. Start with that. Stretch out your back legs. Left, left leg, big lunge forward. Like that. And then just lower that knee, not all the way down, but kind of down. You see it? Oh, it's a stretch in here, stretch in my chest. Uh, stretch right, right underneath my dick quad. Okay, now we're gonna jump up with the right knee uh, and do some bend overs. So, touching the toes. Try to keep your knees straight if you can. I cannot. And then just bend halfway up to where you're like, one well, of that Tetris pieces, you know, the L one. And then back down. Oh. Halfway up again. And let your arms kind of hang. Back and forth. Back and forth. Oh, you might have to touch your... Yeah, your toes should be together. Nope, I was wrong. Learn this. My friend Andrea at a missionary in Northern Thailand, Buddhist monastery. Just go like this throughout the day. Just let it hang, go back and forth. Ow. Okay, and now we're gonna step backwards. Right leg, left leg, or not. Back to downward facing dog. Okay. Okay, oh, all force, as long as we're doing this. Tabletop, whatever it's called. I call it scared cat, dead cat. Scared cat, dead cat. Oh. Scared cat, dead cat. Can you guys also, if you're gonna post on Instagram or something, or in the comment section of YouTube, post your fucking win stories. Some guy said he lost 10 pounds in nine days doing the first yoga challenge. That, I mean, Fat burners, for sure. Uh, scared cat, really stretch that middle of that back up. Uh, dead cat, fucking push that belly down like you're, gonna, like you're gonna fucking belly button fuck somebody. Back in the old days of Adam and Eve, I think they did that, they belly button fuck. If there's a historical scholar, you might correct me on that. Okay. Did you pray the gay away? We haven't done that one in a while. Let's do that one. How shall I do this? From downward facing dog. Big lunge forward with the right. Nope, that's not it at all. Let's just sit on it. Okay. You see this? This is it. Uh, right leg in here. So naturally your left leg is gonna go over like sideways, but you wanna get the knee straight down. Because you are gay 
And you know, it, Jesuits, as smart as they are, still are not accepting the fact that you are who you are. So they're gonna make you pray the gay away. So here we go. And pray that gay, ow! Pray that gay away. Right over that knee. Try to keep your butt down. It's impossible. I don't know how they say keep your butt down over here and keep your dick onto your leg. It's one or the other, it seems like. Either way, you're praying that gay away. Hold it there. Three, two. Do you think a priest ever just wanted to stomp somebody's head when he's like this? Just fucking one time, you know what I mean? Just one time. Somebody's playing like that, and the priest's like, he must. One time. Okay, other way. What do we do? That way? So now here. Left side. Slowly move into this position, too. Don't fucking force yourself. And then train that guy away. Do you really used to think that would work? I mean, what was your success rate from praying the gay away? I didn't make up pray the gay away, by the way. That's a fucking, that's a priest term. I think uh, Michael Pence, Miss, Miss Pence, Miss Pat. Miss Pat has a new show coming up. Oh, good work. Those gay conversion camps. I mean, the counselors must have been gay too, right? Okay. Oh, and back up. Oh, I don't know where we're at right now, but we must almost be done. I feel like we must almost be done. <sighs> Let's do a Shavasana while I think of the next move. That is where you go all the way down to the ground. Fucking, I have my good mat somebody sent me in New York. Oh, I'm in New York. I mean, back at home. <sighs> So all we're doing is just laying straight down. I want at this point, I remember this, this is how you could do it. You want, it's a little bit meditative. So you wanna close your eyes and you wanna feel every part of your body that's touching the ground. Don't push into it, just feel it. Okay, close your eyes, I'm gonna slowly, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a like meditative voice. I'm gonna walk into it. Feel your heels, your left heel touching the ground. Then your right heel, touch the ground. Your you know, the behind your shin, whatever the fuck that's called. Calf? I believe it's calf. Your left calf touches the ground gently. You are one with the ground. And then your right calf, touching, touching the ground. Then, where are we next? Okay, I'll do this so you can hear me. Your butt cheek, your left buttocks, your right buttocks both touch the ground. Or feel you are one with nature as your buttocks touch the ground. Shoulder blades, elbows, backs of your hands, all touching the ground and your head. And as you feel all parts of your body touching the ground, just remember one thing. Barry Bonds and Mark McGuire and Sammy Sosa shattered the home run records through a use of cheating, lying, and covering up to take steroids to abuse the proper home run leader, which was Roger Maris, not Babe Ruth, Roger Maris. Okay. All right. Three seconds to enjoy the meditation. Okay, put your hands over your head, and this is the big fucking sit-up. This is a hard one. I know you guys can do it. It's like a lunch. They do this in real yoga classes. All right, you are a real yoga class. Don't tell yourself short. Ready? One, two, three. Fix it up. Oh, nice. Okay. I said we go for leg touches, right? Let's see where I'm at here. I think we're already at 20 minutes. 19, yep. You guys, let's try to touch our legs. Touch our toes. We're going easy, you guys. We're going easy, because soon, in January, it's gonna be fucking hard. I knew I had a way to do this where I'd stretch and then, okay, so let's do that. Let's stretch out. Um, right leg, point forward, left leg, 45 degrees. And then we're just gonna come over that left leg, that right leg a little bit. We're just getting ready to touch our toes. You can feel it in the back here. That's it. And then we're gonna shift and do the other one. 
All we're doing is stretching out the backs of our, ooh. So we're gonna touch our toes. Do you think we can do it? I've been off for so fucking long. I think there's almost no way I can do it. I mean, I can't even keep this leg straight. All right, remember, when you're touching your toes, it's not just from here. It's not just from here. When this, if this goes up, you have a better chance. Because higher means lower when it goes over. You know, if I'm scrunched and I go over, I only go to there. If I'm up high and I go over, see it? I don't think that was actually a pretty decent explanation. Okay, on three. Don't lunge, but slowly get to touch your toes. We can do this, you guys. This is the sign of we get enlightened. And I want you, we'll do it on day one in January too, but like, notice your fucking uh, progress. Okay, here we go, ready? One, two, three, and over. Touch those toes, wow, I'm not even close. Oh my God. Can you guys see this? I'll go sideways, wow. Not, I mean, that's a two inches away. Oh, oh, that's a lot of fungus in my toes, especially that big right one. Okay, well, we tried and we failed. And that's the first lesson to success. Okay, let's go down and say our thanks. Fucking shit fuck. Oh, it's altitude here. Oh. It's beautiful behind me, top of Arthur's seat in Edinburgh, Scotland. The Scottish people took me in and had to leave, and uh, I appreciate them every day. It's a beautiful December morning. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we're going to give thanks. We're going to do thanks. Big or small, you guys. I think this one, I'm going to go small. I found a new... <coughs> No, no. Uh, what should I do? Let me think. Let's stop and think for a second. Just breathe in while you're thinking of it. Let's do that. Let's take a few breaths while we're thinking about what we're going to be thankful for. And for this, god damn, I can see the reflection of that mountain. It's gorgeous, dude. I mean, this view, that's what it is. It's this view that I have every morning. Sometimes it's not sunny, but today it is sunny, and I'm thankful for that. I'm going to go out there. Take Bannon to a park, let him play with some stray dogs. All these stray dogs, you want to fight. Bannon's like, nah, dude, I'll just be your friend. <laughs> and then they're like, all right, we'll just be friends. Let's run around. All right, so back straight up. Take deep five-second breaths in through the nose, six-second breaths out through the mouth. Just stay thankful for that thing and stay with your back straight up. So every time you feel yourself like scrunching over, go like, oh, yeah, and do that. And every time you feel like yourself forgetting the fucking thing you're thankful for, this fucking beautiful view for me could be your loving wife. Your husband that munches your box when you need a fucking box munch. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's another thing, guys. If you're going to be doing this 30-day yoga challenge in January, you tell your fucking husband, hey, I'm working on my body for you so you have a good body. You need to munch that box. It's a box munching challenge for you. All right, so here we go. For me, it's the view. Let's breathe in. Nice straight back. I told you, uh, an Asian's dick that had surgery to lengthen his dick without realizing girth was a possibility. Straight through your buttocks, up, just pushing top of your, top of your roof of your mouth. And here we go. Five seconds there. And six seconds out. Six. Just do those. Do it to yourself. Just keep that back straight. Keep thankful for one thing. Stay thankful. Stay thankful and keep that back straight. Okay. 
one more. We're gonna take a deep, long breath in. The key to this is the first, like second, shouldn't be like this. And then slow, it should be like this. It should be like this. But with the nose. Okay, here we go. Let it all out and then slowly breathe in. Try to make it last 12, 13 seconds at least. In and then 14, 15 out. But go even longer if you can. And then at the very end, I'll let you tell your, let your eyes flutter open. Here we go. Be thankful. Back straight. And here we go. those eyes flutter open and that's the class today so I was gonna tell you to like sit here and meditate for two minutes but I got this awful fucking siren going off okay that's right Buddha just looked out for us my buddy Buddha who I met there were chance encounter when I was hanging out with Jesus I was sucking Jesus dick Jesus is on earth you guys he's among us and he's a homo Oh, I got a gay skeptic head coming out soon with Mateo Lane. All we do is talk about homosexuality in the modern age. Okay, so make sure you sit here, close your eyes, whatever position. It could even be like this. And um, try to let your mind go blank. Or, I don't know, if you guys got a better way to meditate, I'm all in. But just sit here. That one's too hard going like this. You go sideways. Whatever you want. And all we're gonna do here is just like, close your eyes and breathe in and out. Either think about one thing, like meditate on something, or do your best. This is what they did in that, in that meditation retreat in, in uh, Noto, Northern Thailand. Um, is you just concentrate on your breath. And if you get an itch, you're like, oh, there's an itch. That's just a person with an itch that's happened millions of times in history. And so what is, happens when a person has an itch? He just feels an itch. There's a brain telling me he has an itch. And so then you're removed from it and you go back into like, breathe in, boo, breathe out, duh. So here we go. And just quietly think of, try to think about nothing. Just concentrate on your breath, going in, going out. Your butt touching the floor. If you hear a bird, you're like, that's just a bird. See it, hear it, and try to go back to your breath. Two minutes. Walk into this and breathe out. Ignore all the sounds. Just concentrate on your breath moving in and out. If you have to fart, just fart. It's totally okay. If someone else is in the room, blame that fart on them. Ooh, duh. Ooh. Think to yourself, Buddha. Just bring it back to the breath. Always center on your breath.
Okay, class. So, namaste. That's the class. If you want to sit here, I'll just let the video play. If you want to sit here and meditate more, absolutely do that. Don't tell your loved one or anybody else that you have work to do. If your kid's like, Daddy, you said you'd help me when you finish with this. And you want to tell them, man, I wish I aborted you. I really did. I thought about it every day. I discussed it with your mom. Her mom was really religious, so it was never going to fly. But we wanted to get rid of you. Don't even tell them that. Just sit here and meditate. The video's still playing. Enjoy the nature. Maybe I'll zoom in on the fucking mountain and the clouds. That's what I'll do. I'll zoom in on these mountain and clouds. Namaste, everyone. You have to go back to your day. Everyone else, sit here and just enjoy. Just sit and meditate for a few minutes.